fornicate. I could just listen. <laughs> I could just listen. Uh, I think I'm getting. I think I'm getting close. Uh, copulation. Mm, and tell me if I'm getting warmer here. Nah. No. <laughs> really? That's not one of the four genetic needs. Well, one of them is love and belonging. If you want to interpret it in that way. Okay, I will. Okay. So anyway, there are four. Love and belonging is one. Okay. Fun, power, and freedom. Which one do you think drives you in life? And which Wait, one those are think? genetic needs. It's what he calls his theory. I don't know. I don't. Okay, that's a theory. All right. Okay, so love and belonging, fun, freedom, and power. Freedom and power. Okay. Uh, okay, freedom is number one for me, I think. Mm. And then fun and power might be tied for two, I'm afraid. <laughs> and love and belonging, I think, might be my last one, weirdly. Um, uh, and then for Cass, um, it's not fun. <laughs> Very weird one, but I actually think Cass might be love yeah. and belonging. Yeah. Yeah. Even he's such a loner. Uh, That's and who doesn't belong? <laughs> uh, so love and belonging, uh, and then uh, freedom, and then power, and then fun. <laughs> Did I get it right? Yeah. Great. <laughs> If I have to pick between heaven and earth, yeah. I think Cass at this point will pick earth. <laughs> there was never really a time in his development as a character where he would have said heaven, but I think that time is best. Yeah. Also, the singer yesterday said that if I Castell as a homeless, but I don't agree with that, actually. I mean, yeah. <laughs> I would be very careful about um, that. You can get fired for that. Um, <laughs> we were in the green room earlier and I said something, I don't remember what it was, and Bob's wife said, I'm going to tell Bob you said that. I said, no, 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 no. <laughs> yes. I don't know what I'm saying yes to, but he is homeless. Come on. Where is he? Where is his home? He has no home. Um, just so you know, it's not an effective form of communication what you just did. So I have no idea what anyone said. Well, he said in the last episode that it was staying with him like forever, basically. So that meant that he planned to stay with them. So. so there's a difference, just so you know, there's a difference between having a home and being a stalker. Which is Cass is a little bit stalker. Uh, he's outside again. Is he really? I'm not gonna turn around because it's just gonna encourage him. But you tell me if he's still there. Is he still there? He's just standing there, staring at the window. Bye. Hi, how are you? I'm good, how are you? 